Three Sizzler wins are part of a short but impressive Stafford resume for the driver known as the Invader. Most drivers have early success at the local short tracks before moving into the sport's upper echelon. For Spencerport New York's Maynard Troyer, it was the opposite. He bought his first race car in 1958 for $50 before moving to late models in the 1960s, racing it at New York's Spencer Speedway, leading him to what is now the NASCAR Cup Series. Troyer made 14 cup starts during the early 1970s. He scored a career-best fourth in the 71 Yankee 400 at the Michigan International Speedway. However, his cup career is best known for a crash in his first cup race, the 71 Daytona 500, where Troyer's number 60 Ford flipped 18 times. 18! It resulted in minor injuries. Troyer returned to compete in modifieds, claiming his first Stafford win in the 1975 Stafford 200. Troyer began 77 with a lot of momentum, outdueling Richie Evans in a classic to win the sixth annual Spring Sizzler. But Troyer was not done. He would capture the Sizzler again the next year, before going back to back to back in 79, becoming the first driver to win three Sizzlers, let alone three in a row. Troyer earned six Stafford victories, he would leave the driver's seat to focus on his business, Troyer Engineering, before selling it to his business partner and retiring. We are so close to the 51st Napa Spring Sizzler, and you can get your tickets online for the event at StaffordSpeedway.com. The Sizzler takes place Sunday, April 30th, but don't forget the Napa Auto Parts dual qualifying races on Saturday, April 29th.